somebody like Oscar Valdez is what boxing should be. Yeah. A really nice young man who really tries hard and fights hard. And uh, I can't say enough good things about him. About making history, the best promoter ever, Senis Estrada, Yocasa Valle. It was a great fight. Yeah, that was a terrific fight. She's very, very accomplished. Yeah. I, I had the fight uh, scored the same way as the judges. Me too. Uh, you know, she's scored more punches than the other one. But she's a terrific little tiger. And I, 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 I really, you know, we haven't promoted her that long. Now, Oscar, we promoted from the time he became a professional. But uh, Senesa, we just had a, a few fights, but she's really nice. And uh, you know, she's getting married this summer yeah, like to, uh, to Chris Mannix, Chris which Maddox. is very nice, yeah. So, uh, you know, it was a great night tonight. And I, and I thought uh, 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 Delgado looked really good. And, uh, and uh, our lightweight, Monteo, looked really good. And it was, so it was a good night. What do you so think is next for Sinise Estrada, about? Do I know? I don't know one of these fighters from the other. But the matchmakers are learning about the women, so we'll, we'll figure it out. You Bob, know? tonight, Venato Lopez and Oshaki Foster were in attendance. I think I know why. They wanted Oscar Valdez to win. Do you leave it up to Valdez's team, which one of those two, if that's the choice, who they would face next? Well, or, or neither, because both of them are champions. And, you know, and maybe the better fight is them for to fight each other, mm -hmm. you know, for a unification. We'll see. I mean, you can't make decisions tonight. I mean, that's stupid. So, uh, you know, Asuka has a lot of good opponents to, to fight. And uh, uh, he's going to have, uh, a, you know, a, a future career for the next few years, uh, which uh, he's going to capitalize on. Bob, what do you make of uh, Oscar and Shakur Stevenson's trading, you know, jabs what? back? What do you make of Oscar De La Hoya and Shakur Stevenson trading jabs online on social media? Oscar De La Hoya like, did what? He's trading jabs with Shakur Stevenson online. On Twitter, just taking shots at each other. Who? Oscar, Oscar, Oscar and Shakur Stevenson. Oscar De La Hoya and Shakur Stevenson taking jabs at each other. What do you They're think fighting well, well, social media. Ooh. <laughs> You know, and I'm saying what happened when the, this kid, what's his name, the, uh, the Oscars fighter? William Zepeda. William Zepeda. Yeah, Zepeda. William Zepeda. When he won his fight, it was Oscar that said, bring on Shakur, bring on Shakur. So what we did was we called Eric Gomez and we said, look, everybody heard Oscar. We talked with Shakur. He's ready to fight your guy. Let's make the fight. Nah, he's not ready yet, and all that shit. You know, <laughs> let me tell you something. I mean, if you take a lightweight in the division and you have him fight Shakur, it's like sentencing him to death because nobody can beat Shakur. He technically, he's fantastic. But I didn't open my mouth. I didn't propose it, Shakur didn't propose it, Oscar opened his mouth, everybody heard it. And, and he was the guy who threw out the challenge. But again, what it proves, and I love Oscar because he was my fighter, you know, for the years, but you know, you can't take what Oscar says at face value. You can't, because he gets carried away, <laughs> and therefore he says things that turn out to be stupid. Well, Bob, he is he a promoter, right? Up. What? Well, he is a promoter. Excuse me? Well, Bob, he Oscar is a promoter. Yeah, but <laughs> you still don't say stupid things that you're not going to back up. Right. Now, if he wanted that kid to fight Shakur, quite okay to say that. Yeah. And then we would have probably been able to make the match. But don't say it if you have no intention to put this kid in with Shakur. Bob, Shakur is going to be back in Newark. Um, can you talk to us a little bit about finding him an opponent and the I decision? I think we to found him an opponent, but let my people say 
who he is. It's going to be a very, very, you know, okay. you know I mean, he's going to give Shakur a tough fight. That being said, nobody beats Shakur. I said that. But uh, 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 let them make the announcement when it's appropriate. I don't know if all the papers are signed and so forth, but we have picked out the opponent, and the opponent has agreed, and Shakur is agreed. All right,